Hey guys, Jen and Kay here, and we are at World of Disney, and there is currently no line, so let's get inside. So I've been seeing a lot of talk about Universal and their donations, but I've never actually seen it. But today Universal is delivering to our local food bank. Very cool. So we did run into Vera Bradley because they are open and they have them two of their mask designs in stock. And Kay did see one she likes, so we're gonna go get it. All right, so Kay's feeling a lot better because she's not wearing a Kennedy Space Center one to Disney. But she also said this one's a little thinner and a little easier to breathe. So um, yeah, and these are also way cheaper. They're like $8, so it was still under nine with tax. It was like 8.50 something, I think. So um, definitely if you need a mask, Vera Bradley has some great ones. So one, I am disgustingly happy to be back. And two, there's new merch. So the first thing I see is the new Summer Spirit Jersey. It has a lemon in the D. And it does say Walt Disney World with the lemon design. This is, I don't see a price, so I'm guessing $64.99. They also have the new inflatable pool float summer ears. And these are actually um, deflatable. So if you are taking these and traveling, you can deflate these to help protect them to make them last. It says Sweet Summer on the band. And these are 30 Oh my gosh, how cute are these onesies? They are $19.99, which is the standard for kids' onesies, and it just says summer attitude. I love these. So Kay found a spirit jersey she likes. Um, this is another new one. It's another tie-dye, but this one, instead of just the couple colors, is like a full neon rainbow. So she's totally in for this one. They also have these adorable summer flip-flops. They are $14.99, and they have little orange slice Mickey heads on them. I love these. They also have this adorable women's tee that has just Mickey and Minnie in their summer finest. I love the flamingos. This is $36.99. It's kind of see-through. It's You would probably need to layer because I'm assuming if I held it up to the light it would be very see-through. They also have this new tank top. It says Home Sweet Home. It is $34.99. These are cool, and I've never seen these before. These are a play on the fairy ears, but they have horns, so it's like a unicorn horn pair of ears. These are beautiful, and they just have sequins all over it, and I don't even think it's focusing. And again, they're $29.99. This is a really cool inverted color line. So this is like the green with the blue, on top and this is the blue with the greens on top this is a kid set the long sleeve tee is what fifty dollars well this must be a spirit jersey ah oh, this is a kid spirit jersey for fifty dollars that's ridiculous and then they have the kids t-shirt which is $19.99 I do like this one though they also have this really fun youth hat I'm not supposed to touch stuff, but I can't see prices. And this is 27. Oh, this is like a silky. This is a weird material. I don't know if I like that. I think this hat would be very hot because it's like a polyester almost. They also have a Mickey plush in the same style, and he is $21.99. They even have this um, Wonderground Gallery iconic Mickey uh, vinyl, and he is $29.99, which isn't terrible because he's pretty big. And I like how they have a kids and adults, so you could like do parent and child matching with this set. This is the adult t-shirt, the unisex. I love the neon green with the popping of blue. It is $24.99. And then they have the matching adult spirit jersey to the kids ones, and this one is just the opposite of the t-shirt, which is the blue with the pop of green. Let's see, what's the front look like? And here's the front of it. Not as crazy about this one as like, I like that one better. 
Ooh, these are cool. This is a new set of Star Wars leggings, and this is like all the movie posters and iconic movie scenes. And they're the, the her universe, and they're the standard, $39.99. And for her universe, they have the matching tank top for $34.99. And by our universe, this is like the unisex or men's version. Um, this is the Hawaiian style shirt and it's the same. It's the all over print movie posters. Or actually, no, it's definitely, it says Empire Strikes Back, but it's all the movies. And it's $59.99. And then they have like a unisex jersey style t-shirt with the same with all the iconic scenes in the Star Wars logo for $36.99. Guys, it has been so long since I've done a shopping video. I don't know what's new and what's not anymore. This is so bad. <gasps> this is new. It's a Wishables Parks Food Series 2. The exterior chaser is a Mickey waffle for $9.99. Does not say that it's scented though. That would be awesome if it was. And then inside, it's a cotton candy, a turkey leg, a churros, or popcorn. These are adorable. And again, whether you get the exterior chaser or the blind bag, it's $9.99 each. So now that my brother is having a baby and I'm gonna be an aunt for the first time ever, I spend a lot more time looking at the onesies and there are some adorable ones and they're actually on sale right now. So the ones that are $19.99 each are $15 each when you buy two. So you basically save 10 bucks if you buy two. Oh my gosh, I want all of these. Jimmy's having a girl and I don't care. I'd put them in all of them, put her in all of them anyway. Oh my gosh, here are the girl ones and they are adorable. I love the little peanut and the I'm perfect. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. These are cool. This is a new line. I'm trying to see prices without touching too much. But these are $30 and they're almost like an old fashioned material, like an old fashioned doll. I love these. So I showed the Donald. Here's the Daisy. I love her ponytail. I really, I love the pastel colors and the material is really soft. Although I have to say, I think Dumbo is the cutest. Ooh, I really, really like these. Oh man, some of these may have to come. I'm at home, oh, man. This baby's gonna be so spoiled. From Frozen 2 still, they have this awesome little um, photo op. I think this used to be out in Disney Springs somewhere and they brought it inside into the Disney store. So they have anticipated for social distancing where the queue to check out usually starts there. Now it goes all the way down into the kids area, actually goes down to the window and round and it starts right here. And they have a hand sanitizer right at the entrance as well. I feel like this is new. Again, it's been so long. I can't remember what's new, what's not, what I've shown and what I haven't. But it says fun day. It's this beautiful blue. This is a women's cut and it is $36.99. They also have these really cute like pajama shorts and these would match that fun day t-shirt and they are $34.99. Well, they have a couple different designs in those pajama shorts. They also have a gray and black stripe with Mickey and Minnie ears. Then they have a Mickey premium bar on gray. These are cute. They also have this new sequin Mickey hat. Um, this is a women's, it's an adult's for $27.99 and it's really cute. It's gray with the pink brim and Mickey's wearing pink shoes and pants. Annie that shirt. <laughs> this shirt's definitely right up Kay's alley. It says you had me at Walt Disney World and it's almost like the 80s style workout shirts where you would put this over like a tank top and this is $36.99. They also have this classic princess lounge fly bag and it does have two exterior zippers and the interior and it is $80. This is gorgeous. They also have the same pajama shorts in the My Happy Place and again these are $34.99. And this one straight up exactly matches these shorts, the happiest snacks on earth and I completely agree and it's $36.99. Oh, they've expanded the ABC Disney line where they I started showing the mugs, but this is a throw. It is $39.99. It's 72 by 60, and I love the colors. And it's one of those super soft ones. I don't even have to touch it to know that. 
They also have the ABC line in an apron and I already see Jose and what I don't see is a price tag. Hmm. And the apron is $34.99. My life is now complete. Girardelli is reopened. So me and Kay are gonna split some ice cream. So they currently have a very limited menu. They only offer three Sundays. Um, just some of their, wow, they're down to only one, two, three, four, five flavors of ice cream. Helps if I show it. And then just their traditional hot cocoa and some milkshakes. They only have four milkshakes right now. So they have severely limited their menu here. So right now the self-serve station with the sink and where you can get your own spoons is closed and the indoor seating is completely closed but they have these amazing gigantic hand sanitizing stations. I love it. It's okay, I already went for the cherry but we are so happy we're splitting a hot fudge sundae and we're kind of doing things out of order because we're doing dessert before lunch but we weren't going to walk all the way across to walk all the way back to walk all the way back again so we're just, we're doing life right. How happy are you that Ghirardelli, Ghirardelli is reopened? <laughs> That's a happy kid. I have to say, the Disney nature is very happy to have people back that they can steal food from. Look, they're congregating. This little guy is just patiently waiting for someone to drop food. Sorry, I don't share my Ghirardelli. And we have our first casualty of war, Kay. We had just slid our mask down instead of taking them off and K drip chocolate, but at least it's gonna smell good for the rest of the day. So every time you breathe in, it'll be chocolatey. Stop number one and stop number two are done. Stop number three is the Marketplace Co-op. And it does look like there is also no line to enter here, so we should be able to get right on in. Okay, got ridiculous excited when she saw these. They are Disney themed dog dental treats. These are Nightmare Before Christmas. They have Oogie Boogie on them. They're $11. <gasps> Ooh, we're gonna have to come back and get some of those for Zoe. But they also have a Toy Story version. Um, these are really cool. And I love how it's like all different Toy Story characters on it. And Lee, next time we come back, we're buying this mat and that water bowl. So be prepared. Little dress shop. One, we just did a quick walkthrough. There are no new dresses, but the dressing rooms are closed. So if you're not sure your size, beware, because you cannot try anything on right now. Can I tell you how ridiculously happy I am just to be able to walk through that? Do you really like that one? I want to look around first. Okay, you can get, look at me. Because you finished eighth grade, you can get one postcard print. So choose wisely. And this is the postcard print Kay decided on. She's actually been eyeing this one for a couple years. So she finally decided, because Mulan is her favorite princess. So congratulations on graduating eighth grade. So now let's go celebrate with lunch. lunch. So right now the only Disney stuff that's open is World of Disney and Marketplace Co-op, which includes trendy, little dress shop, Disney Tales, Wonderground Gallery, Centerpiece, and 21 in Maine. The Once Upon a Toy and Disney Pin Traders are still closed. I was speaking to a cast member. There is no date for reopening, she said, but Disney Springs is supposed to be completely reopened before the parks open. So this will open back up prior to July 11th. So I have had a request to show the Lefty's Left Hand Store and some of the stuff they offer. So um, it's open, so let's do that. So they have some really fun t-shirts, like it's a lefty thing you wouldn't understand. And they're not bad. These are cheaper than Disney prices because this t-shirt is only $19.99. And then they have whole left-handed geared like stationary sets. They have some left-handed coffee mugs where the design is made so you can still see it if you're holding it with the left hand. They have a whole bunch of different lefty t-shirts and again they're all $19.99 although the kids ones are only $16.99 I like these ones so this is awesome they sell a bunch of different left-handed pens and pencils like this one is basically a trainer for kids who are learning how to properly hold a pencil with their left hand they just have these were my favorite pencils when I was a kid the little click ones and they have them for adults now um, so you can write with a pencil left-handed 
These two pens are made so that you're writing over your hand, so you're not smearing it, and the pink one is made to dry instantly, so as you're writing and rubbing across it, you're not smearing all the ink. These are wicked useful. So they also have left-handed made can openers and left-handed rulers, which I didn't even know was a thing, and I never thought about how a left-hander using a ruler, it would be upside down. This stuff is genius. And it looks like Rainforest is still closed, but again, T-Rex is open. So if you have a Landry's, you still have the option of T-Rex. Ah, so over here by T-Rex, BB Wolf's has reopened. And so did the Lego store. So Lego store is also open. And today is Friday the 29th. So today is the first day that Terralina is back open. And I know my friends Kim and Rudy are going there, but we're gonna be turning because we want some pizza. So you'll see the um, construction walls in front of Homecoming because they are completely redoing the front seating area because they enclosed the back porch so there would be more room with AC. So they're completely redoing the front seating area. We have made it to Blaze and it looks like there's no line for this either. We picked the perfect day and the perfect time to come. So I am super grateful that we could find an inside seat because it's currently 90 degrees and the heat index is at 98. And why is it focusing on you and not me? <laughs> I'm the one talking. Look at me. There we go. That's what's important. More. It does. But um, they're doing a really good job of the social distancing inside and outside here at Blaze. And I'll show you how they're um, blocking off the tables. So basically every other table has a sign that says distance makes the heart grow fonder plus it's safer. Please choose another table. I love that. Um, I didn't give you permission to eat yet. <laughs> Go ahead, I don't care. So we just got a build your own pepperoni pizza and then I got garlic knots because I normally eat a whole one of those by myself but because I'm sharing with Kay, I needed something more to fill me up. And with the new social distancing and all and safety um, enhancements, they no longer have the self-serve um, grated cheese. You don't have to ask for packets, but it's still good. So it is now after 1 p.m. on Friday and it is definitely getting busier. A lot more people out and about and walking around than there were when we got here at 11. Aw, someone's doing graduation photos. Looks like a high school graduation. I'm not sure who you are, but congratulations. All right guys, well that's gonna do it for us for a quick little trip to Disney Springs. It's just too hot to do too much walking around. World of Disney was open. I found a bunch of new merch. So excited to be shopping again. And I actually got to spend a little money buying her a graduation gift for eighth grade. So if everybody in the comments below could give a big congratulations to Kay. She's the high schooler now, I'm so happy. But if you guys like these videos, please click that subscribe button, tap the like, and ring that notification bell so you always know when a new video is headed your way. Thank you so much for watching, and now we're on to the next adventure. Bye guys!